Good morning, everyone. Steve Georgie here from Allendale's Trading Floor. It is September 9th, so it's, well, ahead of a USDA report on Monday. Um, but we've got some evening up on position. Grain market's rather quiet today. As of right now, corn's only down a couple cents. Beans are actually up about a half. The wheat market, though, however, pulling back about six. But as we move forward, what are we looking for? Well, USDA's report on Monday is going to be another reminder of big ending stocks again. And so, what, 2.3 to 2.4 billion carryout? Looking at strictly the yield isn't going to matter. We, I think everyone agrees that USDA probably needs to make some adjustments to the yield and maybe have that reduced a little bit. But overall, even if we do see a reduction, what are we going to look at? 2.2 billion carryout? It's still a big number. We've seen a good rally over the last six days for corn. We've rallied up almost 25 cents. That's great. But I'm still talking to guys out there that still have old crop. And what do I do with that? And then a big crop coming behind it. There is still this, uh, this, this sense of what do I do with this crop as I get it? We're going to store it. We bring it to the elevator, which is potentially full. Um, what are we going to do with it? What kind of in infrastructure do we currently have? Same thing on beans. It'll be a reminder on big, uh, big ending stocks yet for beans. We're going to be looking closer to 330 million carry out yet for beans. Does that mean we should be closer to this $10 area? Probably not. But we've seen a decent rally out of beans as well. In big crop years, we tend to make our lows in the month of September. So we'll see. I just feel still that we need to be very careful yet. Yes, this rally still feels pretty good. But overall, we may have some downside still ahead of us. So be careful with that. If you need help looking at just ideas and what do I do at these levels or what kind of ideas moving forward, give us a call. We're here to help you with that. Because there is a lot of grain out there. There's a lot of old crop still sitting in the farmer's hands that needs to be moved. And we got a big crop behind us. So be careful with that. Um, looking at some of these outside markets, you got the stock market down over 150 points right now. A pretty sizable move. The dollar is higher. Crude oil breaking back a buck and a half right now. There's a lot of concern out there uh, with, with North Korea successfully firing a missile with a nuclear warhead on it. And that has caused some stir and caused some commotion uh, around the financial community. And so what's going to happen with that? We'll have to wait and see, but that is putting some pressure on things as far as the financial world. Uh, that is giving the dollar a little bit of a boost right now, which in turn could be negative for commodities. So uh, be careful, but a lot of stories out there. But we are finding pressure as far as the stock market here this morning. So uh, we'll see as we move forward. But stay in touch with us. Give us a call. We're here to help you out. Report on Monday for the grains. Uh, I hope everyone has a good weekend out there. You can reach us at 800-262-7538 or on the web at Allendale dash inc.com. You guys have a great day, great weekend. Talk to you again Monday. Take care.